Hey coaches, this is Bubba, uh, the YMCA Sports Director. Uh, just trying to speed through this real quick. I've got a long list of stuff. I, I'm going to have it emailed to you, but I also want to go through it a little extra few things. Uh, like I said, my name is Bubba. I've been here for about five years as the director. I've been working for with kids for about ten years. The YMCA mission is to put Christian principles into practice through programs that build a healthy spirit, mind, and body for all. Uh, try to remember that everyone plays, everyone wins. We don't keep score for any of these games. Uh, the four core values are honesty, respect, responsibility, and caring. Uh, added faith for soccer is uh, because we've got extra fields, and it helps remind kids of teaching points. It's uh, very effective. Speaking of effective, effective coaching, uh, it's real important to be organized, use checklists, use the website. The website has everything you need on it. Um, you, when you get your roster, check, for, check the phone numbers, check emails, check shirt sizes, uh, make sure everything's right. Um, remember you're a role model. Uh, showing up on time, wearing your shirt, that you're going to get the first game along with all the rest of the team. Uh, it's, it's real important to show up on time, um, be a good example, and, and uh, you know, just don't yell at kids, get on their level, uh, be excited, uh, be positive. Um, and, and kids are kids and parents are going to know when you're not prepared either. Um, yeah, plan ahead, know what you're going to do in practice. Uh, if you need help, I've got soccer books to give you drills. Um, with equipment for the youth, uh, it depends on what practice time. So uh, if, if you're going to get equipment, uh, I've got two bags uh, for field seven, field eight for the first and fifth grade. I've got two bags. Um, say you're practicing on Monday at 5.30, um, and uh, you will pick up the bag uh, of balls at the YMCA. If somebody's going to practice at 7.30, um, they're going to bring the balls back on the same day. Now the person in between just has to use that bag. Okay? You got that? It's real simple. You'll get, a, you'll get an email soon. Um, uh, next thing is uh, with the with the weed, the equipment, I'm going to have ba balls out of the practice time and game time uh, during that, that hour that they are out there on the field. So if you want to bring extra balls, it's totally fine, too, and I have goals and everything. Uh, for the practice for youth, like I said, I'm going to send you out a, 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 a sheet of what you can pick. You're going to have three choices. You, I'll try to give you your first choice for practice. Um, and, and with practice, let your parents know that if you're going to cancel because of weather, I, I don't make the call on practice. I only make the call on game. So remember that if you are going to cancel practice, call your parents individually or email them, let them know, make sure you follow up with them, say, hey, we're not having practice tonight. I'm not going to do that. You guys make the call on what you want to do for practice. I'll, I'm only going to make the decision on games, make the phone call to you, you call the parents, okay? Uh, with the formation for uh, the Wii, it's four on four, uh, no goalies. With uh, first through second, first and second grade, there's six on six and a goalie, so there's seven total on the field. With uh, third, fourth, and fifth grade, there's five on five and a goalie on each side, so that's six on each team at, at one time. With substitutions, try to sub the kid every quarter, every half, whatever you want to do. Try to kid play every kid every spot. It's required in YMCA rules. You play at least, uh, at least half the game for each kid, or given the opportunity to. Um, with the Wii, we don't switch sides uh, for them. We warm up on the goal you shot on. Uh, when you, you sh shoot on the goal, you warm it up on. Uh, but we are going to switch half, uh, switch sides at half for first and fifth grade. And before the game for first and fifth grade, we're going to do a pledge uh, for all the kids. Uh, with the ball size for we is size three. With the older kids, first through fifth, we're going to use size four. Um, with the goals for we, we're going to use four by six little pop-up goals. Try to keep the kids off them for me. I've only had them for a year, and they're already getting kind of worn out and torn up. So to help me keep them out, they're going to be staked in the ground. Um, with the older kids, the, the big goals are going to be staked on the ground, so try to keep those kids from hanging off, hanging on them. They're going to be 6 by 15, they're real big. Um, and, you know, I've tried painting them and getting all the rust off, so a little safer too. Uh, with kickoffs, uh, little kids, little wee, they're going to line up on the first kickoff for the, for, at the beginning of the game. They're going to line up and the ball's going to be rolling out by either one of the coaches. And then uh, with the, with that, at that time, uh, they'll just go after it. Uh, say blue team scores, then red team, pick a little Susie to kick first. Then blue team scores again, pick a little Tommy, and vice versa. That way every kid gets to play. Um, now also, uh, with, uh, with the older kids, you must uh, also have uh, two in the circle. And uh, when, you're, when, you're, when you have the two kids in the circle, uh, make sure that first kid, he, he can kick it or pass it or whatever he needs to do, but he needs to make sure he doesn't uh, touch the ball twice. Okay. Uh, with uh, referees, there's no referees for the Wii. Coach is going to keep top watches, and it's going to be four six-minute quarters. Uh, there'll be rest for the first and fifth graders. Uh, remember, the, the the gameplay for the Wii is one hour, okay? So it's one hour. So you have a game at 9 o'clock. You're going to have 20 minutes of practice and 40 minutes of game time. Okay, so 9 to 9 is practice. 9 to 10 o'clock is game time, okay? No throw-ins for the Wii. Try to keep the parents around the outside so they keep the ball in. Um, the code of conduct, make sure the parents read it, uh, print it, sign it off, sign it, and send it back to you by the second game to give to me. Um, and snack sign-ups are really, really important. Uh, it's more important to the kids in the game, so make sure parents sign up and make sure they show up too. Uh, the last thing is clinic, the clinic on Saturday. So with the Wii at 9 o'clock, 
They're going to have 9 and 9.45, uh, a meeting time, meet with the coaches, meet with the team, knock the ball around, I'll have balls out there. And then at 9.45, I'm going to have some OSU athletes sit down and talk to them. And the same thing is going to happen from 10 to 10.45 for 5 and 6-year-olds. They're going to have that time, and then I'm going to have some OSU athletes. And then at 11 15, I'll start having the clinics with OSU athletes for the older kids, first and fifth grade. So if you got any questions, email me. Let me know. I'm going to have this whole script uh, emailed to you, and uh, we'll go from there. Thanks.